we will start the next session next lab session of c preprocessor macros so what we are going to do is we are going to learn about some macros and we will see how they work so let's try to see this code so here we will use so macros with arguments so we will use macros c macros with arguments so this is our first example we see so dash define square we give the argument x and then that is going to be replaced by x into x so wherever our in the code there is written as q u a r e square and x so it will be replaced by x into x so similarly so first let's see what happens here so we come here so print of square of 2 is percentage d and i write square 2 so when the compiler before compiling it is seeing this square so it will be replacing square 2 with 2 into 2 so after compilation this will give the answer 4 and we will see printf square of 2 is 4 which is perfectly fine. But let's see the next example. So what happens here? So there is a catch. So we see square of 2 plus 3 is square of 2 plus 3. Its argument it should have worked for a function and we are happy that it will work for macros. So what happens now the compiler comes to this line of the code and it writes so square of 2 plus 3 it happily replace it with 2 plus 3 and then uh, star 2 plus 3. So when the execution takes place so but it gives the wrong result why because now it is 2 plus 3 into 2 plus 3 which is equal to 2 plus 6 plus 3 which is equal to 11 so it's not what we wanted our answer should have been 5 square is equal to 25 but we are getting answer 11 so what went wrong thing was i'm just asking the computer or the compiler to replace x with x into x so that's why when it's something like 2 plus 3 into 2 plus 3 so there is no parenthesis and this gets the higher priority so to correct that thing we must do so this is square correct x is equal to we put a parenthesis before and after x on both the sides so now when this is getting replaced at this line so we see so it becomes now 2 plus 3 when it expanded so there is a bracket also into 2 plus 3 3 so this is the replacement text and now what happens this becomes equal to 5 into 5 which is 25 so this becomes all right now so let's see some more examples so here this one is the example so what happens here is we are now trying to do max and mod so max of a comma b so we do some kind of if else kind of thing if a is greater than b so then a or else b so again we put parenthesis so that we can cover some complex arguments here so when we say max of 3 comma 4 so it becomes this expression max 3 comma 4 becomes 3 is it greater than 4 question mark 3 colon 4 so 3 is greater than 4 this statement is false and hence its expression is given as 4 the result is 4 and next is how to write a mod so if x is greater than 0 then x or else minus x and so for mod of minus 5 we try to calculate so is minus 5 greater than 0 so then minus 5 or minus of minus 5 so minus 5 is not greater than 0 so answer becomes 5 so this is about modulo 
operator now let's see some of the hash defines to make the code look much cleaner so and and equal so ampersand ampersand and equal equal for some of the beginners so they really find it uh, amazing so why even surprising that why they take two equal for checking equality and two ampersand for checking and but like so and only one equal for assignment so for them we can write if total equals 240 and average equals 60 so these two keywords now make the code much cleaner so these are the use of c preprocessor macros and then we so show some nested macro definitions of cube of x as we have already defined square correct x so we just multiply it with x and it gives us the cube so now just let's see and compile this code so when we compile and run it so we see square of 2 is 4 so that's perfectly all right with the square function but square of 2 plus 3 becomes 11 as we saw because there was problem of parenthesis and then we corrected it by using square correct and we got the correct answer now max of 3 comma 4 is 4 mod of minus 5 is 5 and then equal so this was true so it is giving us the next statement that's correct cube of 3 is 27 which is getting correct so this was the c preprocessor macros with functions arguments so this ends our lecture